everybody reaper here behind the scenes and you know they put the new roof on last year but before that they had some water leaks and some of the you know uh, skylights and Richie and Josh and Austin here and Nate is here uh, they're all working yeah, he don't do much. <laughs> <laughs> we just missed it too bad about five minutes ago if I would have filmed sooner Richie was knocking down a piece of board pendulum right over Austin's head came back and nailed him <laughs> hey Austin show us that red mark on your neck no that's that's a hickey yeah. no <laughs> <laughs> Get all that done, and then the uh, paint it. Then this room will be finished. And Austin, he brought some coverings that Rich is talking about and Bellagio's. We'll go back and take a look at those as well. And then he agreed, I guess he's going to make some here out here, but those will be black. He's going to cover the 700 and the thousand with them. Yep. So we'll go in the back and take a look and see what those look like. And Big Rich, of course, he's the supervisor. <laughs> Bam, the Bellagio tanks. And look at the skirts on the bottom. Holy cow. What a difference, huh? Yeah, that looks so much nicer, doesn't it? And we can take a look at the chiclet. Or, no, cichlet. Aha, cichlet. I think I said it right that time, people. But... <laughs> awesome and like I said you're gonna do the same thing for the 750 and the thousand out there rich just said oh yeah that's gonna be in black so looking good I guess these are just magnetic let's see yeah they're magnetic it's got magnetic strips on them so they just bam right there awesome and we might as well say hi to all the fish in Austin cool dude he was really nice he knows I've been trying to get some clams for Lavaca and he brought me some wasn't that nice of him so guess what we're gonna do a little feeding for my girl Lavaca I'll get that on video as well I've been dying to so. hey guys Forget Reaper's video, it's behind the scenes, it's garbage. <laughs> Check out Ohio Fish Rescue's video that has all this and what we do in one day, okay? In one day, this is Sunday, our day off, this is what we do in one day. Now, Reaper's got a cute little behind the scenes, you know, it's so cute. <laughs> no, you're doing good, Reap. Here, let me give you a pat on the back. There you go, buddy, you're doing a good job. <laughs> Got all that? <laughs> okay. Oh, 
Alrighty, so I opened up the bag of clams. Let's toss one right in and see if she goes for it. Yeah, hopefully nobody's better. It doesn't look like it, because she's trying. Come on, girl, you can get it. Come on, honey. There you go. Go for it. Like she eyes it up and goes for it. You can do it. She got it. Look at that. She finally busted it open. Yeah. Those are some strong teeth. You don't want to get bit by her, that's for sure. Oh, yeah. She made... Oh, she... Oh, God. Look at that. That was awesome. Jeez. I'll try one more. They're kind of big though, so let's try this one. Oh boy, she goes right after it. She must really like some clams. Tastes good. Oh, wow. She broke it already. Wow. Wow, that one was... That was only the second time she attacked it, and she broke it already. Look at that. That's amazing. Get just the meat and slap out the rest of the shell. Go. Wow. Nothing but shell left. Indeed, a bit. Yeah. 
Wow. She cleans it really good. That a girl, Ivanka. Yeah, two of them in one day. Awesome. In reality, that took a little over 15 minutes to, for her to crack them both. The second one, as soon as she hit it the second time, bam, it was busted, just like that. But finally got to eat her for some real clams there that weren't too big. The muscles were too soft. These were just right. You need to collect your plants, buddy? Fine. Well, now, we're going to put a bag because they don't need to be in water. All right. So if you take, okay, you take this one, and then you want some horn work too, right? And then there was a third one you found in there. Hold on now. And then you take this one. Now that'll grow into a colony at your house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll give you some. <laughs> Woohoo! There's the horn work. I don't know about a third kind, but this is the other stuff. And this is just float on the top, cover your whole top of your tank. What is this one then? Because there was something else, there was a third plant you pulled out last time. I don't know, but yeah. there you go. There is a pound of plants, and that'll cover <laughs> the whole top of your 55. It's covering my hand, there we go. You can't even tell anything's missing. High fended banded shark. Yes, very good, <laughs> Reed. You're learning. He's all happy. <laughs> I even went in the back and said chicklets and said, nope, they're cichlids. They're, oh, he got <laughs> that right. Wow, you're learning, I, son. I think I finally got it. <laughs> Did you see that water out of nowhere start squirting at me? That was uncalled for. <laughs> Wow, that one there is almost like translucent. A couple of them are. And of course we gotta check on the Phantom Cats. Uh, there's one of them. Nice and goofy. Here's Josh's dolphin fish. I don't know the name. Uh, there's the other one. Look at side. Look at how big he is compared to my hand already. Remember when they came in his bags? They were they weren't very big. Look at how big he is already. Uh, they're getting big, fast. That's just awesome. He's doing good. Oh, look at that one. Way up on top, just floating. You don't see him float often. That's unusual. Or maybe not. I don't know. But that's the first time I've seen one floating. Hmm. That was kind of cool. Check out the 1,000. Bigger smile. Come on, baby, smile for us. Show us that big mouth. Not today. There's a little baby fly turtle behind that fish right there in the back. There he is. He's always hiding in one corner or the other. And let's go say to hi to our buddy. Check his back. Oh, looking better. Let's see if he can try and bite me. Oh yeah, one of these days, Vince, you're gonna get bit though. Because <laughs> it's hard to see where my hand is in relationship to the camera. So one day he might get me. Hopefully not. Wow. He's getting better and better all the time. Awesome. Uh, let's do this. Here you go, buddy. There he goes, you see it. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. 
loves those things. <laughs> Not very good at catching them though. It looks like the box turtle just made a mess over here. It looks like we have to open it up a certain bit. Just a little bit. Mm -hmm. Chair. A lot of people have been asking for a video on African finish that OFR has. So I asked Big Rich about it. I thought we were, might do it today. That's what I was hoping to do as a video putting out. But you saw the work's been going on. I got here at 1 o'clock. They've been at it since 8 o'clock. Uh, they got all kinds of work done. They got the uh, Frontosa tank clean. They got the light on uh, Josh's bass tank, the uh, uh, peacock bass tank fixed. The uh, the 1000 that had that uh, sand volcano, a sand waterfall in it, that was filling by accident. And that's what happened there. That's empty. They're going to fix, repair, and I believe sell. And the 580 is going in place over in that area. So stay tuned for those videos coming up. Thursday, I believe a bunch of people are coming out. It looks like Monday, tomorrow, we, Rich and I might be going out to Franklin County at the Beulah. Pick up a one foot clown, flower head, flower head, I think you said. So we'll see about that. Hopefully we can do that one tomorrow. All right, they got what they needed out of there pretty much, cleaned up everything. Uh, the pieces of board, the board they bought was too short. I gotta get some more boards and some other things. And then they'll be able to get up here and finish that repair and get that done. And the other day I showed you how we're extending this so you can see Rich cut the one side, comes out over here now, and the other side's already there. These aren't gonna work, the ones that Josh bought, they don't fit. This part here does not fit for some reason, so. Uh, rich and uh, that's what they actually did this morning like I said this morning they cut the original ones that we still have outside they cut these down the size and they're in the garage they got weld these ends on now and then those extend from here to there and then we got the shelving outside up against the grill right there and those will go in here and that'll take care of the rest of the pallet racking so, getting it done slowly but surely before spring. Hey everybody, Reaper here. Hope you enjoyed the video. As you saw, a lot of things going on as always. Um, and the tarp came up in the back again because of the winds. So, we got to think about some way of tying it down so it doesn't keep coming up. But in the meantime... It was awesome that uh, Austin came out and brought those clams for La Vaca. That was great. And everybody's been asking about the front take, so here they are. The discus, they're, they're hiding the silver dollars. They're hiding in the back right now, but our other guys are doing just fine. Those tiger bars are awesome. Uh, so we got a rescue hopefully tomorrow, me and Big Rich. Hopefully we'll get a video on that, and we got a bunch of other things coming up. So you stay tuned, and please, everybody, if you can, subscribe, share, post, do what you can, and we'll go deeper with the Reaper.